Hello, I'm Dr. Jimmy Douglas and it's important to remember that steam inhalation doesn't kill any viruses and scald injuries are on the rise with people indulging in excessive steaming whenever they have flu-like symptoms. A burn injury is caused by dry heat such as fire and a scald injury is caused by hot water or steam. Steam inhalation is being practiced traditionally for the relief of stuffy nose and common cold for its hypothesized potential benefits for reducing mucosal edema and clearing the passages of thick secretions. And another important thing is it is also not recommended that you use essential oils in the boiling water for steam inhalation because doctors are seeing cases of essential oil induced seizures. So coming to the nebulizer, it helps deliver the medicines directly to the lungs for local action by converting the liquid medicine into a fine mist. Can nebulizer be used as a steamer? No, it cannot be used as a steamer. When recipes containing drugs are used, the nebulizer converts the liquid medicine into a fine mist to be delivered directly to the lungs. It's only used for medicine delivery as advised by a doctor and no, you cannot use water in it and it cannot be used as a steamer. Another often question asked is, can nebulizer provide oxygen? No, the nebulizer cannot provide oxygen. The nebulizer uses compressed air to convert liquid medicine into a fine mist or spray. As you know, the oxygen concentration in the air is around 21% and even if you keep a high speed fan running in front of the patient, even then the oxygen concentration is 21%. Only the oxygen concentrators, they can concentrate the 21% of oxygen found in the air into pure medical oxygen, which can be useful for patients with low oxygen saturation. Thank you for your time and see you in the next video.